Welcome. Today I'm going to show you how to make bottles in Figaro using lathing. And I like to work from an image when I make a bottle. So let's do right click, set background image, drag a bottle image, right click, top view, select it. Let's move it over. I want to use the right one. Okay, that looks good. We're going to use create and polyline. And we do not want snap to grid. We want to do freehand. And we're just going to click all the way around and all the way back to the bottle. I'll show you. So click, left click, left click. And every click creates a vertex. And you go all the way around the edge. You don't have to be too precise. You can adjust it later on and smoothing will uh, make it look better as well. Little edge here. All the way back down on the inside. Double click the end. Don't want to see the background image anymore. And select the polyline. Okay, let's adjust it a little bit in vertex mode. So you can move single vertices, multiple vertices, and you can insert new ones. So let's try to do that. So let's move all this over a little bit. It's too close to the middle. So you do a shift and select multiple and stick to the blue and red arrows when you move to make sure it stays in the plane. So like that. Click on the plane to deselect. Click on the vertex to move a single one. Move that one a little bit over. If you want to insert a vertex, use knife and hover over an edge. Double click. Okay, looks pretty good. Let's see what happens when we lathe this. Edge lathing. And we're going to pick an edge. Turns blue all the way around 360, 24 seconds. Okay, let's see what we created. Top view. Not exactly what you wanted, but it's a pretty weird object. And why does it look so weird? Because we didn't line the edge up for lathing with the, the Z axis. So let's do that. First, we want to decrease the size of the grid. Click in the grid. Left square bracket button on your keyboard will decrease the grid size. Snap the grid. Vertex mode. Let's push this one over a little bit. There we go. Let's push this one to the Z axis. Let's push this one over. Okay, it looks better. Let's see what happens now when we edge lathe. And we pick the same edge again. Edge. Sometimes it's hard to see if it's selected or not. There we go. All the way around 24. Okay, let's see what this we created this time font view yeah looks good nice bottle if you want to make it more smooth go to objects and smooth and do okay and it makes uh, makes it look better in uh, 3d rendering okay thanks for watching you can watch more tutorials at figaro.io